Good morning. It's Saturday at um, eight twenty already, and morning's flying already. Uh, this is Crackers Crazy Living. Today I am decorating a baby shower cake. Um, the theme is sloth. So uh, my friend wanted um, a like a tree trunk looking cake and then we're going to put greenery on it as far as leaves with frosting um we've got these little gold candies we've got green candies and we've got white candies that we're going to add um they got a really really cute tree topper for the top of it with a, a it's a tree and it's um got a little sloth hanging out of it uh, we're also going to have a sign that says, Oh Baby. I'm going to put that somewhere. Um, I'm going to be putting JJ on it somehow, either on the board, Welcome JJ, or uh, something. So I um, thought I would come on and do my decorating on video. I've never done cake decorating on my video. Uh, I usually just kind of get into my own element and just kind of roll with it. So we'll see how this goes. Um, I made some moss last night, edible moss. It's really kind of an interesting recipe. It's super easy to make. And um, we're going to use that to enhance this decorating cake. So it's kind of like it's spongy. It looks like moss. It's really kind of cool. So I'm going to use that, and um, so we're going to get get going with the creative process. I got all kinds of uh, bags filled here with frosting. So here is my tree trunk looking cake. It's a it's a two tier. This is a ten. This is a six. Might be a seven. I think it's a six. But she wanted it to resemble on the outside like a tree trunk. Um, now I'm going to add the embellishments to it. Um, I've got my piping bags. I ran out of um, disposable piping bags. So I have just my regular piping bags here with my couplers on the bottom. So I can switch out my tips if I want. Um, I love these little in these little closers for the bags. Kind of hard to see. They're really kind of fun to use. I have a habit of squeezing my bag in the middle. So it, the frosting squirts up to the top. So you just put these little bands on and it holds your bag shut. So when you're piping, even if you push it this way by accident, um, it won't squirt up and out the top like it normally does on me. It's just a bad habit that I got into doing, uh, probably because when I fill a piping bag, I max it out, and you're not really supposed to do that. You're supposed to leave some space in your piping bag. There is a max fill limit, <laughs> but I seem to exceed that a lot of the time. So it's just something I, it was just a bad habit I started, and I can't seem to break, so... Um, my eye itches. So we're going to get going with this decorating here. I took two photos that I had, uh, and I'm kind of using that as a guide, but it's in my memory because it's on my phone. And since I'm videotaping this, I can't get it out of my phone. So right now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to Start embellishing with some of this green frosting. And we're just going to see where this leads. I mean, it's just kind of a shot in the dark. I haven't done this cake before. This is, like I said, it's, it's, it's two designs put into one. So I'm not really sure how it's going to turn out. But, you know, we're, we're going to just do it. And we're going to see... How this goes. So here I'm just using some uh, green, making some stars. 
Oops. If your frosting doesn't want to cooperate, that doesn't help. But you know what? I can cover it up with a leaf or something. She wants these gold bar balls, the uh, green balls, the white balls on there. And I, I really don't know where that is going to take me because I don't do a lot of balls in candy on um, cakes for boys. This is for a boy. I don't normally do a lot of that for a boy, but we're going to... We're, like I said, we're kind of winging it. Now I might have to make more green frosting because um, it's almost the same color green, just about. I did a moss green and a juniper green, but the two greens almost um, almost look alike. They're pretty close, and they weren't really supposed to be. My Cake was in the fridge overnight. So we'll see how this looks. Um, let me do some, oops, getting it on my table, of course. I make such a mess. All right, let's see what we got here. She also has these other leaves. Maybe I'll get the rice paper ones first. We gotta find a spot to put this old baby sign. Usually it goes right on the top, but she's got this really cute little topper. It's adorable. It's this cute little topper, and it has a sloth hanging out of it, like that. And that's gonna sit right here on the top. That's gonna be adorable. So I'm not sure where I'm supposed to put the old baby. Um. You know, maybe I can, I don't want to cover it, the cake up. That's the problem. Maybe I'll take them to the party and ask her where, how she wants to use them. She may not want to use them after all. And if she doesn't, I don't know. I'll buy them from her because I'll use them at some point. What did I do with the other one I just had in my hand? I did not have it in my hand. All right, so I'm going to just set those aside. So let's see how we're going to do these. Uh, these are rice paper leaves. She bought these online because she liked these leaves. Even though I pipe leaves, I can make leaves with frosting. She wanted these. Rice paper leaves incorporated. So maybe I'll just put them around like this. The frosting is set overnight. I stuck it in the refrigerator. So it's, you know, it's been set.
Yeah, those look okay. I don't know if I want to put them around the bottom. I don't, like I said, I don't want to cover everything up. Maybe I'll save some um, to put around the topper or something. I like creating things with frosting. Um, that's my take on stuff. I know how to make leaves with frosting. So, all right, let's do a couple of, uh, what, wait a minute, let, let me finish this. Look, I'm trying to figure out some of these balls. Let me put a white one here where that other leaf is. Yeah, that's probably going to look good. Don't know why she was going with this particular look with the balls, but I said, I'll. I'll figure it out. I'll get it on there. All right. Let's go with gold ball here. You know, sometimes when you cake decorating, less is more. But when your client wants what they want, you got to kind of do it, you know. You got to make your people happy. makes it look like flowers. I don't know. It's kind of cool looking. I think I'm liking how this is coming around. All right. I got those on. Let's put some up here. You got to put these things on when they're, when your frosting is still soft. If you put them on, try to get them on when your frosting has set. It's not the easiest thing to do. I don't really, it's just hard. Uh oh, what's that? Piece of fuzz or something. And you can't get away from that either, you know. You try so hard not to get fuzz or hair or anything in your projects, but sometimes, you know, stuff happens. All right. You have to squeeze some frosting to get those on there. I don't know. All right, I'm going to set those aside. Let's do some leaves. Let's see. How do I want this leaf to come out?
save some frosting to do a couple of leaves around or maybe I'll put moss around the topper I guess I used the same color for these little tiny leaves. All right, I want to see what this. I have a tip here that I don't know what it does. Maybe I'll practice on a piece of paper or a plate before I. Maybe I'll just put it back in the bowl. Oh, that's different. I don't know if I'm using it right. Hmm. Maybe I think it's meant to droop over. So I just kind of did that and I did that. That looks pretty cool. Do some long dangly leaves. Looks pretty cool. Oh, it looks pretty neat. This tip.
I think that looks really kind of cool. All right. And more little tiny leaves here. Yeah, just put some little tiny leaf things on this long squiggly thing kind of leaf. Eleven thirty. Because I just thought that because you said last night you wanted to stop and get breakfast. Oh, that looks well. What do you think? Oh, that looks cool. See, and this topper's gonna go on top. I'm not done yet. I got the moss to put on here and there. That looks really good. All right, good. It's helpful to know. I need to put frosting in the bottom and smash it down in there. She wanted these rice you. paper leaves. I'm like, why do you want that crap when I can hand do it myself? Who knows what people want? Oh, Amy, Amy just doesn't know. Yeah. Maybe what you can my do. My scope of stuff. I've yeah. done. I've done Skyler's cakes forever, but.
Your steak looks really good. Oh, shoot. I should have paused you. <laughs> I forgot I was videotaping. Oh, boy. I just, well, maybe I can try to edit this one before I just throw it up on my page. Maybe I can try to edit this, you know. Put some moss on here. Where to put the moss, you know? Where do you stick moss? On the bottom? Just lay it here and see how it looks. I might have to just stick it on. think when you make this moss you think that's not going to be enough moss but it's very spongy and you don't really need a ton of it I'm gonna put it all the way around the base I've got three different colors of moss yeah I put some moss around the top of the tree you know I mean around the base of the tree It's really kind of interesting stuff. I've never even made this um, mossy stuff before. I've never made it before. Kind of interesting stuff. It's edible. It's cake, actually. It is, um, I used an egg. I used uh, sugar. I used honey. I used um, flour and baking powder. Let me try some other color. This is really going to be kind of cool. I'm I'm kind of enjoying this one a lot. It's always nice to do something out of the box. This video may not be a talking video. It might I might if I have to go in there and do um Um, if I edit this, it's going to be sped up anyway, so I've never edited videos before, you know, I might have to try it. Where am I going to put JJ? I have to write JJ on it somewhere. I don't know where I'm going to do that. There's some other moss. I had three different colors. I had this light green. I had this dark green. And I have this green.
and you don't need a lot like I say you don't need a ton I might put some around the hopper. I'm going to see how that's going to look. All right, that's what it's going to look like. And I got to figure out where to put this old baby. She just went it in the front. Maybe I'll stick it in this. I don't know. I'll have to figure it out. Maybe I'll take it to the party and we'll figure it out there. Because I don't want to cover up all this, you know, beautiful piping that I've done. I'm gonna stick these this moss down there and against those other little leaves to try to hold it up maybe hold up those leaves
I think that's going to be it. You, you, it's really a fine line between doing enough and doing too much. It's very fine line. It only takes a couple extra little things to go, oh, no, now it's too over the top. I think this looks really cute. It's got the gold ball she wanted. It's got the green. It's got the white. I did the moss. I think the moss looks amazing. I really like how it turned out. I just got to figure out where I'm going to squeeze JJ on there. Maybe I'll just get some fondant out and just do two J's and stick them right here. You know, I can fix them with water or something. It's going to be on the front somehow, so it's either going to be here or here. I think it turned out really nice. I think she's going to love it. All right, that's it for cake decorating today. Um, come back to with you on another day with another project. I got another cake next week. Maybe I'll come back and, and do that one. So um, this is Crackers Crazy Living. Uh, thank you so much for joining me. If you have not subscribed to my page, please hit the subscribe button, ring the bell for notification, share me with your friends, and give me a thumbs up. That would really help me out. I'm going to probably edit this one, so I don't know if they'll actually be talking or if it'll just be sped up. I don't know. Since I forgot to put you on pause and you sat there for the longest time, maybe I can shorten it a little bit somehow. All right. That's it for today. Have a great day, everybody. Talk to you soon. Bye.